Happy Thursday, crafty friends. I'm coming on today with hashtag ATC MDC Open Collab, hosted by Life with Patty and Bonnie's Corner, and Twenty Thursday, hosted by Jan Crafts and Tea with Janet Kay. So yesterday on Embellish with Us Wednesday, I made these little ghosties and their little jack-o'-lanterns. So today I'm going to make Twenties, an ATC, and an MDC. So I got all my pieces cut out here. So, my first thought for the MDC was that I wanted to use a haunted house. So, I cut my haunted house out of this gray um, glitter paper. And then I cut another one for stability out of 110 pound craft cardstock. And when I was cutting it, I stopped right here and left this section. And then I, I cut it out and kind of made a, a heel down here. And so, I was like, okay, that's good. Okay, well, then I was thinking, well, I want something shining through the windows. And um, so, I had this paper that I got from Hobby Lobby. And so, I cut two big circles. So, instead of it being sort of shining from the outside... It's like it's the moon. So I'm going to glue those inside there. And then it'll be pretty on both sides. Like that. So we're going to do that first. And, um, and I'm going to leave a place open at the top. So I can slide. Um, I'm not sure if it'll be this or not. I'll probably make it round too. Whatever I slide. Used to slide down in there for my information because so it won't show, you know. Or I'll put a little ghost at the top. Might do that. All right, so I'm just gonna go about to there. Stick that on and make sure that I have the open part at the top. Put some glue on all my small little areas. Like that. And I want my moon about like that because I want the color to show through. And I, I was thinking this might be, no. I thought it might be, um, it has a very odd feel to it, and I thought it might be sticky-backed, but I don't think it is. I think that's just, it just feels odd. It's a very different kind of color. It's not black, and it it's kind of like a, it's, it's a really, it's like charcoal, I guess you'd say. All right, so, hopefully I didn't get that down too far, and I did. But that can be fixed. Okay, I I really like the way that's looking. All right, so let me get my scissors, and I'm just going to make my heel side match on both sides. Like so. Now, if I'd lined it up, I wouldn't have to do that if I'd lined it up perfectly, but I didn't. So, no worries. I don't worry about things like that. Just take care of them. There's a little hump right there. There. It will drive me crazy unless I cut it off. Okay. So, there's that. So, now I'm going to glue my little ghosties on. I kind of want them hanging off like that, and these are pastel, and y'all know usually I don't I don't do pastel, but since I colored these with my um, metallic uh, watercolors, I thought, well, what that'd be perfect with a little pink moon back there, you know. And 
there. And I might save him for one of my other pieces. Okay, so then I also the other day I made these tags with Scrap Diva Designs um, set of stamps and dies. And I thought, how cute would that be right there? And it would add a little texture. So we're going to glue that on. And I think that is stinking cute. Okay, so there's that one. So now let's make the ATC. So I always back my ATCs with some other kind of sturdy paper to give them some, some oomph. And so there's my oomph. And um, I think I'm going to, oh, let's see. Hmm. <laughs> okay, I'm going to use these two on here. And she's going to have this little bucket. Well, let's see if I can get this, this bat on here. Oh, yeah. These bats might be a little afraid. I mean, the ghost might be a little afraid of the bat. How about that? Who knows? Who knows? Or maybe it's the other way around. But they're ready for Halloween either way you look at it. So I'm going to go ahead and make both of these. And then I'll do, I mean, I'll make like the twinchies and this one first. And then I'll distress around the edges. And there's her cute little bucket. And this is a um, die set from KS Craft, if I didn't mention that. All right, so I'm going to do the same thing with these. on there. See if I can hold on to it without dropping it. Got my Halloween decorations put up outside uh, this morning. It's a little bit cooler here. Thank goodness. Okay, so I'm going to put these on here a little bit wonky because, you know, those probably don't fly straight up and down, do they? I don't know if they do or not, but we're going to say that they do not. All right, so there's, that one's holding a little basket. Got its little jack-o'-lantern pumpkin. And then this one's going on here. Like this. We're going to give him this. We're going to say it's him because he's green. He has a little happy, happy honing basket. And these are thick because I cut them out of watercolor paper because that's what I always do. And then, I'm trying to decide, do I want to go around the edges in black or do I want to use... Let's look in this drawer here. Let's see if this is still juicy. Is not. Alright, so uh, let's see. Let's use this. So this is Opal Magic. using this. <sighs> Probably don't have enough room. Hmm. Okay, we're not going to be using this. Let's see if we can find another color. That one goes blue to gold. That might be better anyway. I'll shake it up and then I'll see if I can pull it off. Hercules. Oh, look, that one's sealed. I'm 
definitely doesn't look like I shook it enough. All right, so now that I know that I can actually get the lid off, we'll shake it up a little bit and make sure I can get it moving around in there. Because that's all the yummy at the bottom. What is it? Tim Holt says ring the bell. Ring the bell. Let's see how that looks. Oh, yeah, I can see it in there now. All right. So this should just give it a little bit of iridescence around the edge. Because, you know... Oh, yeah, that's pretty... Your ghosties, you gotta have a little shimmer, a little shimmer and shine. Oh yeah, I really like that. You can't really tell a difference until you look at the one that doesn't have it on there. I wanna make sure I get it on that black good. Because there's a tiny bit of a black line showing right there. Which we don't worry about. Oh yeah, I like that. So we can't leave this naked. Let's put some, oh, it turns gold. How cool is that? You know, gotta have a little bit on the edges of your moon. Some vapors building up down there. Yeah, and I'll put it all around this tag too. Oh, I got a lot there. It's okay. I want to look at more over here. Oh, that stuff is. Can y'all see that? Oh, mercy. Some pretty stuff right there. Okay. So there we go. Now, I could put a little boo on here, but I'm kind of liking them. You know, I don't usually do um, pastels, but they turn out pretty stinking cute. Okay, well these are both open collabs, and uh, anybody can join. You can join lunch, you can join every week, you can, you know, as many times as you want, so. And you can make anything, it doesn't have to be Halloween. I always say that because, you know, I seem to always make Halloween, although sometimes I do Christmas, and after Halloween, I will be doing Christmas. So, y'all join on in and um, and have some fun, and get your stash built up. All right, hope you have a wonderful Thursday. Love you guys. Blessings.